Okay, so I got the camera mounted on my chest. Now I have it tightened. Everything's holding. So, like, if you don't want to see the transactions, um, okay, so you can angle it down. There's this tightening thing right here. You can angle it down. That way you don't have to show the transactions and people don't like their faces. Or you can hold it up like this. It has a phone thing on the back, like it opens up. So for different size phones, and you can tighten it down. And it has a tightening thing on the bottom that latches the two pieces together. Here, I'll show you. Um, it has the tightening piece. Um, get the camera right. See, it's hard to do. Let me, let me angle it down. Um, this piece right here holds the two pieces together. And when it's clipped in, this thing on the back, this opens up for different size phones. Right here, it opens up, and you tighten this down, and it locks it in. And then down here, this little thing here, um, if I loosened it, it'll the phone will fall, so it gives you a chance to adjust the angle. I look really funny, so I'm gonna find a mirror, but let's walk around and see how it does. Um, <clears throat> give you a, like a preview of the store. This is our sales area. That's all the stuff I listed on eBay in the last two days. Um, this is like a bag of stuff we have to go through. See, it's not showing everything. I'm trying to get it all where it's all chest low. Okay, it might be a little shaky, but this is our. So let me let me bring it up a little bit. Here we go. That's the crafty shack area. That's what it is. I can't. The problem is I can't watch what I'm doing. <clears throat> that looks better. There we go. Okay. So this is our store sales floor area. Crafty shack's over there. Let me see what it looks like jumping up here now. I hate that it bounces a little bit too much. This is like where our register's at and my eBay stuff over here. Okay, we'll take a little path. Oh, I need to get this stuff and go to my office. So y'all gonna get to see how dirty my office looks. I sewed this on eBay yesterday. Yes, my office is a mess. And it's priority bail, so I have to get a priority bag with the priority bags are in my office. The rest of the shipping stuff is right here and mixed in with at the shed. Alright, let's take a path <clears throat> through the office here. Through the store, I'm sorry. I'm going to preview this and see if it really bounces that much. As you can see the back here, we got movies, video games, shoes, book section over here, we got cards, we got our Halloween um, outfits over here, our blue jeans section over there, so I'm just kind of giving y'all a small little tour here um kitchen household stuff and back here behind this was our <clears throat> our sales area but we got a huge donation and we had to block it off i'm about to sneeze so just bear with me <laughs> i knew that'll make the phone bounce for sure <laughs> yeah see that was our one of our sales area but i'll go back to the other side in a minute this is our kids section back here I need to quit putting my hand in front because it's messing up the thing. Um, this is where people drop donations off back here. So we kind of keep this area somewhat straight the best we can. <clears throat> I'm just giving a tour of this so I can see how bad the phone bounce is and all the other stuff. Because I've got a bad leg and it's not helping me with the bouncing. But this is where our clothing goes. You guys can see. Um, these are all the veteran shirts I made one of every military color. I love the black on black though. Um, let's see, more clothes. Hopefully this video looks good so it wasn't a waste of money. More clothes. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> this is our terrible area back here but it'll be alright. This is where all the magic happens for the shack. Test not the thing here. This is where clothing layovers at which 90% of them are upstairs and I'm not going up there right now lonely offices I'm not going in there and I have to go in mine unfortunately but we'll do that in a second 25% <clears throat> of this building is shack another 25% was eBay and then the rest is store so this is this was the eBay section put. We moved the eBay to the house and we're turning this into the shack. And then <clears throat> back here was the big donation. So 
it goes pretty far. So we had to cut off the plastic section back here, like plastic bowls and Tupperware and all that stuff. And then back here, there's another yard sale we haven't got to. Well, this is all my eBay stuff. It's not listed yet. This is all my stuff I have to list. Stuff I need to take home and um, stuff we have to go through. But anyway, that's not what's important. This wasn't my processing area, but I've basically moved up front. Yeah, let's go get this priority bag and then put this package together and then this is a huge disaster of an office, but I'm never back here, so I don't really care at the moment. <clears throat> but this went priority, so I have two different ones. I have the regular priority bags and then I have the uh, <coughs> Express, <coughs> which I don't ever use Express. <laughs> my sneeze messed all my sinuses up. But you know, like my Romo jersey. So let's go get this ready to go and then I'm gonna check the video and see how well this thing works. Whoa, see look I just dropped down that time. So apparently it's not tight enough. I don't think I'm worried about my bounce. Because my leg. I'm worried it's gonna bounce because I limp so much. Okay. <clears throat> it's a very small item and I would usually put it in a um, instead of sending a priority I would usually send it medium mail but in a little bitty bag but they wanted a priority so it has to go in a priority bag and I don't have any small boxes so basically what I'm going to do is put it in here <laughs> roll it around a couple times seal it and just give enough space for this right here to go on there Let's see what I'm talking about so if you do it like this you fold it up a timer too. Put this in the corner. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to seal. So and oh I don't want to do it like that. I'm just gonna leave it like this. It's not the worst in the world. But it's priority and they'll take it. They'll ship anything as long as you can put it in a package. They don't have, I mean, if it's like regular mail, but priority has to go in the priority package, so. There we go, now let's have to get the post office. And see, I can wear this camera when I'm going to the post office, but I'm, I'm pretty sure you can film in there. <clears throat> but anywho, let's see, let me undo this out of the thing. Put the camera. Looks like I'm carrying a small baby, but hey. So far, so good, let's check the video out. Hey guys, welcome back to Picking for Profit YouTube channel. Uh, today we are going to preview an item I've got so we can do videos uh, that are so like in state sales and bin places so I don't have to hold my phone the whole time. That's the positive, the negative is I won't be able to look up any comps. So I'm going to go on my jet feeling and what I've learned over the last two years. But we're going to open this up, <coughs> preview it, put the phone in here, walk around the store and see how it does. And then I got this uh, Bluetooth remote shutter. No way I don't want to take the phone out if I ever want to hit the pause button in case somebody complains about being filmed or tells me to turn it off or whatever. We can hit this button, no I have to undo the phone. Okay, so let's check out this. It's called Coreal Mobile Phone Chest Strap. I don't know if it'll be I think it's what it says. It's hard to read it, but maybe it'll say it different in the package. Check it out. Uh, Installation diagram looks nice. Uh, it is. I don't want to say the name there, but it's pretty cool. I'll put that there just in case I need the instructions. Comes with this fancy case here. Let's see what's in the case. Oh my gosh. They came to be. Okay, what is, okay, so parts are in the case. So I guess you get uh, the phone holder in there. This, I have one for the GoPro, but I can't ever seem to find all the parts. And GoPro, you have to you know, load it on your computer, and, and all. it's just a lot easier to use your phone. I can upload straight to YouTube from the phone. So it was only, I think I paid 15 bucks for this maybe, but it works every time if you can, God, if you can use it. So uh, I'll be going to the bin place Friday, and I'm going to wear it and try it out. Unless they tell me I cannot <clears throat> film in there, so we'll see. Let's open it all up here. So it's a nice 
pretty plastic on it, but I'm going to put it on. And I, I have a um, thing that I have to go get a priority bag for, so you might see my messy office. But well, I'm a busy man, so I'm going to help that. Okay. Let's put, put it on first. Put what on? The last outfit you'll ever wear. Okay, so I have a little <clears throat> clip right there. And I'm a big guy, so I might as well go ahead and stretch this out to as far as it will go before I even start. Because I'm never going to be able to put it on. I've got wide chest and shoulders. So we're going to go ahead and do max. I can always bring it back down. The max size here. Let's see what happens. And then I'm going to pause the phone there and put the phone in here see how it works. Okay. Let's put this puppy on. <clears throat> that has to go like that. I'm trying to figure this out. This must go over your head and your shoulders. And I don't mean the shampoo. Okay. Crap. Where's this guy? There it is. We're all so Okay, so it's maxed out and it's pretty tight. That's good. That means it won't go nowhere. It's very stretchable, so I like that. So the good thing is it will stay put. <clears throat> okay, installation diagram. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> okay, this is the phone holster here. goes like this and this screws into the bottom of it here um, okay. so it screws into the bottom here pretty simple instructions so far okay it's gonna say it's got a tightener on the bottom so when you have it on your thing how does it look to the right side, so that needs to go there. And you can adjust it with this thing on the bottom to keep it straight. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so we got that right there. Okay, now this is on there. <clears throat> I wonder why. I get this is the part where your phone is. Why is this silver? I don't know. See what we got here. I'm doing this part without instructions. I need to figure it out on my own. It doesn't go that way. This is going to have to set like this. <coughs> Maybe I'm going to have to use the instructions. <laughs> That does not help me at all. Oh, okay, it got pinchers. Okay, that makes sense. So you pinch this together. Maybe it. I have to go on this way. It doesn't pinch that in. Please don't break it. in there, <clears throat> then this 
cannot be correct unless this rotates, but this doesn't rotate. This cannot be right because if your phone goes in here, oh, I know why. Duh. Because your phone camera looks that way. That makes sense. 